While you're at hudking.com, click on the bird to follow us on Twitter, click on the F to follow us on Facebook, or put a street name or zip code in the search bar and see other real Hud King virtual tours. We are here at 8510 Timber Ranch. That's 8510 Timber Ranch. A very charming three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath home. Obviously two-story. Approximately 1,903 square feet. Built in 1993. Exterior is a combination of wood siding and brick. It does have some nice mature trees on the property. Let's take a look at the backyard. Now it does appear that some of the siding is coming loose. And around the chimney here, it does seem to be a little bit damaged. Also, obviously we're missing a side fence. I just walked straight to the back. And most of the lower part of the property is, uh, of the home is actually brick, which is good. It's very low maintenance. And exterior wise, it just really looks like it needs a few pieces of the siding replaced and maybe paint the trim and the fascia and the trim. We have a little concrete slab back here and pan around and give you a view of the backyard. Not a bad property. Let's take a look at the inside. When we're walking up to the home, it does have this really cute little front porch. Not really very deep. I mean, I suppose you could put a chair there and sit on it, but you'd be pretty close to that railing. On a few of the bottom portions of the pillars, there is some wood rot. Not really major, but, you know, it's something that cosmetically you'll want to address. Um, pretty house. So we walk in and three bedrooms, all three bedrooms are going to be located on the upper floor. So downstairs you just have your living room and your, basically your, your family rooms. So you walk in and it does have ceramic tile here on the entryway. To the right here you have really a, a formal living room. It's going to need carpeting and painting. You have a formal dining room here. These windows give it a lot of natural lighting. And then we make our way into the kitchen. Now it's a nice layout. You have an island kitchen here. Uh, lots of cabinet space, lots of countertop space. If we pan back towards the front door, to the left here under the staircase you have a little pantry. To the right you have your utility room and more pantry space, so your washer and dryer connections are going to be here. And then you have your garage here, access to the garage. Pretty standard two-car garage, nothing major fancy about that. And then back up towards the front again, you do have a half bathroom right here. So your guests don't have to go upstairs. They can use the single vanity and commode there. And if we continue through the kitchen, you do have a little breakfast area here, which is probably where most of your dining will take place. And then you have your big open family room here. Family slash living room. It does have a fireplace and a vaulted ceiling. Now, this house does sit kind of high on the lot, so there's a little bit of settling. It is not major. Just a tiny bit of settling. I'm not sure if you can see it with the lighting there, but you want to get the ceiling retextured and, and fix that. And they did kind of an interesting decor thing here. They put faux brick and a little light. Interesting touch there. Now there is a $550 repair escrow to address a small plumbing issue if you get an FHA loan on the property. So they have this runner carpet going up the staircase. And when we get to the top of the staircase, if we pan to the right, you have your master bedroom. Now the master bedroom has laminate wood flooring and it's in good condition. Probably really just could use a fresh coat of paint in here. And then with that little amount of settling, uh, fix some of the trim work there. It looks like there might even be a tiny little roof leak. If we come to the right of the master, you have your master walk-in closet. They continue with the laminate flooring in here. It has a window, so that's a nice master closet. And then the master bath has linoleum flooring and it's coming up at the edge there, so you probably want to replace that. But a neat thing, it does have a separate shower and garden tub, and then you have dual vanities. How about those sinks? That's definitely 80s style. 1984 is a good year. Master bath really just, I'd say, replace the flooring and put in carpet, uh, put in a um, new paint. We have to the right of the master, the laminate wood flooring continues, and this is bedroom number two. Bedroom number two needs a fresh coat of paint, and it looks like they did have a little roof issue there. Um, they, you can kind of see the different color of painting. They looks like they painted it. Yeah, bedroom number two, same thing with the wood flooring in here, and the ceiling looks fine in this one. Maybe just a fresh coat of paint. Uh, they didn't really do a good job of this trim, in my opinion. I'd probably change that. And a little closet in there. And then lastly, you have bathroom number two. It looks like it's been recently retiled around the shower, shower tub combo there. Uh, single vanity, really interesting sink. 
and it has linoleum flooring. So definitely the home is going to need a fresh coat of paint. It's going to need new flooring, uh, a little bit of sheetrock work. Maybe have somebody inspect that roof so there are no longer any leaks. Let me give you a formal summary. There it is guys, 8510 Timber Ranch. That's 8510 Timber Ranch. A very charming two-story, three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath home listed right now for only $116,000. It does need a little bit of work, but don't forget there's a $550 repair escrow if you get an FHA loan to repair a small plumbing leak. So guys, if you're interested in this home and you don't have a realtor, I'd love to earn your business. You can reach me at 210-706-0616. My name is Jonathan, I'm the HUD King, and I want to help you find your castle.